If you've been subscribed to the channel for a while, you might remember this video that I put out back in January, where I set myself a personal goal to sign Lionel Messi for Oxford United in FIFA 18 career mode. At the time, I wasn't really too sure there was much chance of making it happen. The transfer negotiation system has since been completely revamped though, and this year it might be genuinely possible to do it. He's available on a pre-contract in a 1st January transfer window, and having tested out a few different signings in the game so far, seems that whatever team you're managing, as long as you can afford their wages, you can sign any player you want. So, for today's video, I'm not just going to be attempting to sign the Argentinian for Oxford, I'm going to be testing out whether or not it's possible to sign him at every single level of the Football League, from the Championship right through to League 2. And if you like the sound of what I'm doing with this video today, there will be plenty more career mode content and experiment videos coming at you throughout the course of the year, so if you're not already subscribed to the channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button right now, and if you do go on to enjoy this video, leave it a like too. Before I go any further though, I just want to say a massive thank you to OneFootball for sponsoring today's video. It's an absolutely fantastic app that I personally use every single weekend to keep up to date with the latest goings on in football, and I find the live updates particularly useful with Oxford. I no longer live in the area so I can't personally get along to too many matches. Every time there's a goal though, the app lets me know about it, and I can keep up to date with the latest goings on. You can also follow your favourite players in world football and see how they're getting on too. And basically, if you're a big fan of football, then it's a brilliant app to keep up to date with the latest news, scores and goings on. And the good news is that it's completely free to download. So if you've not already got it installed on your phone, definitely check out the link in the description down below. Give the app a try, and I'm sure that you won't be disappointed. So once again, massive thanks to them for sponsoring today's video. And like I was saying before, today we're going to be attempting to sign Messi on a pre-contract basis for football league teams of all levels. We'll be starting out with Fulham in the Championship, so let's get right into it. So, we won the European International Cup, that gave us an extra 4 million to play with. We then sold a couple of players to Leeds, and McDonald went to Burnley for 3.4 million, so... Fingers crossed that we've now got enough money to sign up Lionel Messi. It looks like it should be possible. We've got 21.75 million in the transfer budget, 114 grand in the wage budget, and if we convert that all into wage budget, how much are we going to have here? just under a million pound per week. Should be enough to sign up Messi. He might want some sort of performance bonus written into his contract though, so let's go with a 22.78 split. 732 grand in the wage budget, 5.6 million in the transfer budget. Let's get into the talks and let's see about convincing Messi to join Fulham. Here we go then, here comes the moment of truth. Messi has arrived at the office and he expects to be the first name on the team sheet. In a championship team, I reckon that's probably fair. And he seems to be pretty happy to hear that. He wants a two-year deal, and once again, that is not going to be a problem. And once again, we get a nice big smile from Messi. And he doesn't want a release clause written in, so that's good to hear. This is where things could get a bit difficult, though. Getting him to agree a contract offer. He's on half a million a week at the moment, so let's just start out with that. Apparently, he does want to join Fulham, but he wants 490 grand a week, plus a sign-in bonus of 4.15 million. We do have the money for that one, but I feel like we could maybe get a slightly better deal, so let's try 490 grand a week with a 2 million sign-in bonus. And this time he's requesting 470 grand a week with a 4 million sign-in bonus. Once again though, I feel that we can maybe save a bit of money, so let's try 440 grand a week with a three and a half million pound signing bonus. His agent is clearly getting a bit angry now though, so this is obviously going to be the best deal that we can do. 470 grand a week with a four million pound signing bonus. Let's accept it, the idea of the video is to test out whether or not it's possible, and by the looks of things, it is. Handshake sorted, and Lionel Messi will be joining championship side Fulham for season two. We're only 18th in the table at the moment, so we're not even a good championship team. Nonetheless though, Messi has agreed to join us. Let's take a look further down the table though, and you can there see that Wolves and Sheffield United are both in the relegation zone. Both of those teams are absolutely flying in reality, so not entirely sure why they're in the bottom three, but there you go. 
It is only a game, and it's clearly got things quite wrong there. Time to test things out with a League One team this time then. Ruffles has gone to Zurich, Ledson has signed for Sheffield United, Eastwood went to Birmingham, Thomas went to Bolton, Ribeiro went to Shrewsbury, Hall went to Bristol City, Hemmings has signed for Preston, Martin signed for Millwall, Nelson went to Burton, and let's take a look at what sort of budget that's given us. Will it be enough to sign up Messi? Once again, we've gone forward to the January transfer window, and this time it's gone right down to the wire. With eight hours left to go, you can see here that we've got 10.5 million to play with, and it just about gives us enough wage budget to sign up Lionel Messi. Hopefully he doesn't want any bonuses though, as we just can't afford it. Once again, he expects to be the first name on the team sheet, and once again, that is perfectly fine by me. Look at that lovely little smile from Lionel Messi. He is clearly absolutely delighted to be talking to Oxford United. And who wouldn't be, let's be honest. This is where we need to keep our fingers crossed though. At the moment, he's on half a million a week. That is all we've got available. In fact, we've got £967 spare in the wage budget, so let's chuck that in too, and hopefully, Messi will be joining Oxford United for the second season. Let's keep our fingers crossed, toes crossed too, let's make it happen. And there we have it, Messi's agent said that it was a fair offer, everything was on the line, and thankfully, Messi has agreed to that contract offer, so it's possible to sign him for a championship team, it's also possible to sign him for a League 1 team on a pre-contract, can it be done with a League 2 team though? Let's find out. Morecambe have got the lowest transfer budget in League 2, so I probably won't be able to afford his wages. But let's go forward to January, and let's see if he'll at least enter talks with us. Nope, we definitely can't afford his wages. We do have 100 grand in wage budget to play with though, and for the team with the lowest budget in League 2, that is not bad going at all. Let's go over to the transfer hub though, and let's see what message we get says that he's not looking to relocate at this time. Same message with Sanchez. Looks like this player is unwilling to relocate. Same with Iniesta. Same with Ozil. And the same message with Chiellini. One player that would be willing to join Morecambe though is 87 rated Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Not entirely sure why he's the only player that would, but there you go. Nobody else will, but apparently Zlatan will sign for anyone. Good to know, I suppose. I'm not entirely happy to leave the experiment there, though. The thing with Morecambe is that they have the lowest budget in League 2, so it could be the case that if we take charge of a team higher up the table, he will join that team. Let's give it a go with Coventry City. They've got a higher club value than Oxford, so... If we can't sign in for Coventry, it shows that it's a league reputation issue, and if we can sign in for Coventry, it shows that the club reputation is what matters. We've got 126 and a half grand in the wage budget this time, but would Messi entertain the thought of playing for Coventry City in League 2? Let's go and take a look and let's find out. Note once again it looks like this player is unwilling to relocate. Same with Sanchez, Ozil, Leno and Chiellini, once again though, Zlatan Ibrahimovic would be prepared to play in League 2. So once again, that is pretty good to know. Now then, as the original inspiration for this video was to test out whether or not we could sign Lionel Messi for Oxford United, I'm now going to get into a bit of gameplay and see how he gets on for us. I'm not entirely sure who's written this news article though, but apparently Lionel Messi came up through the Oxford United youth team. Given that he's now 31 years old, He's been waiting a while for his debut, hasn't he? Anyway though, weird news article aside, let's get into this game against Portsmouth and let's see how Messi gets on as captain. I've also brought in Tammy Abraham on loan, Chelsea are paying half his wages and there are a few changes to this team. Basically, I sold off a lot of the players last season so that we could sign up Messi and as a result, we had to pick up quite a few free agents. Hence why there's so many changes. Here comes Salah now then, plays that one to Messi. He looks for support, moves it through to Tammy Abraham, goes for goal. He's hit the post. And we've got a good chance here of hitting him on the counter-attack. We've played that one through to Messi. Can he get past his man? He can. He's through on goal. He gets taken down in the box and that is a penalty. And you know who's going to be taking this one. No red card for Donahue, but anyway, up steps Messi to take this one. Slots it away in the corner and it's 1-0 to Oxford United. Messi has scored on his debut. And here goes Messi once again. Can he get a second here? He's raced past his man. Going to go for the finesse shot here. 
not the right decision, unfortunately. Here comes Tammy Abraham now then. Moves that through to Messi and he's got yet another chance here. Surely he can take this one. No, once again, I've made a complete hash of that. Should have had a hat trick at this point, but because I'm so terrible at finishing, he's only scored a penalty. Messi played pretty well there, to be fair to him. Unfortunately for him, though, I was controlling him, so he only scored one goal. Probably should have had a hat trick. With my finishing, though, never likely. Anyway, though, regardless of how I played in that game, back to the focus of the video. It is possible to sign him for a championship team or a League One team. You just can't bring him to a League Two team, which I guess is fair enough. Anyway, though, thanks for watching. Have an awesome day. I hope you've enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you again next time.